Ladies and gentlemen, I was right. Yes, I know, hold your applause. I was right that Emily is going to be a great character for the future. And the future is here because Genshin Impact 5.0 livestream has shown that Emily is going to be good with the character Kenich, which is going to be a character, five star character, that is going to be released in Genshin Impact 5.0 phase two we've seen a little bit in the genshin 5.0 live stream that emily is going to be a great great character for that or she's just generally going to have a team with kinich which is very very important now she's only in the banner for seven more days well six days ten hours in eu and it's not a lot of time you guys have to consider whether you want emily to play as part of Kinich's team. Now, personally, I went for Emily thinking, hey, she's pretty fun, new reaction, I'm gonna try her out. But now, she's going to be great with Kinich, which is going to be a character that I'm very, very excited for. Or he is a character that I'm very, very excited for. Now that I have learned that Emily has value in that team, thanks to this little, little uh, Luminous case, I'm very, very excited to try out that team. And I'm happy that I got Emily because they will go well together i'm not gonna say that they are the quote-unquote best team but they are definitely a team to consider whenever you want to have a team for kinich kinich is going to be a dendro carry uh because he's going to be a dps as well as a single target dps which is a very very important thing he's not going to be aoe like maybe i'll hate them so it is very important to uh, think about the other characters within your team that are going to help you out just to dish out more damage. Obviously, since you are using Emily, you're going to need a pyro character on the team. And this pyro character has to be either sub DPS or you switch out to them, do a little bit of pyro, switch out and then burning, you know, still applies. That is very, very important to note, which means while using Emily, you are still going to need a pyro character, which means three slots are already filled for that team. You're going to have Kinich as your main DPS, and he's going to be your on-fielder. You're going to have Emily, which is going to be your sub-DPS, and you know she's going to be off-field, so you're chilling. And then you're going to have a pyro character to help Emily help <laughs> Kinich do more damage. I'm not saying... Emily's going to buff. No, I'm just saying she's going to do the sub DPS, which is massive actually, which is pretty, pretty good. Now, what does this mean? Does she have a uh, best quote unquote team with a certain Kinich? No, not necessarily. But what we can uh, figure out is that they're going to have a good team. We've seen it in the 5.0 live stream. And I keep mentioning that because it is there and I'm very, very happy that it is. And they've shown us a little glimpse of what is to come. Personally, I'm very excited for the character Kinich because man, does his character just look like he's straight inspired from Kingdom Hearts and I'm all here for it. And then there's Emily, just a brand new character. Not a lot of people like her or like her design, but I personally think she has a lot of untapped potential because of her sub dps capabilities as well as the burning reaction thing it's very very important to note that without the burning she's kind of very mediocre and i definitely think that she needs that reaction to uh, deal any damage <laughs> considerable damage that is especially because of her passive that yeah you just go absolutely crazy with uh burning so, yeah definitely definitely need um I should have clicked on this as well. Definitely need burning on your team for Emily to do much. But all I wanted to say is that I was right. Yes, I am boasting or gloating or whatever the the word is. And yeah, um, do you still have time to get Emily if you guys are considering uh, Kinich's quote unquote best team? Again, we don't know yet, or at least I don't know yet. Um, but yeah, it's going to be pretty much it. All I want to say, hopefully you guys did enjoy. Let me know what you guys think. Are you guys going to go and get Emily just for the sake of Kinich? Or are you guys going to skip Emily totally and just go straight into Kinich's banner? And hopefully other teams can provide what you want. Obviously, there are many, many other teams that you can use with Kinich. It doesn't have to be an Emily-inspired team. So there is that. See you guys in the next video very soon. Let me know in the comments. I'll see you guys.